Hey everyone, wanted to tell you about my house uh, for sale. Uh, uh, there's two houses on this property. They have two addresses, uh, 1420 and 1418. Uh, 1420 uh, is a 1920s house uh, that's been heavily remodeled. It's uh, very well insulated. Uh, it's got a gas stove uh, for heat, uh, and it's uh, the the 1418 is a manufactured house. It is brand new. I installed it last summer. Uh, it is electric, uh, everything. Um, it's uh, an Energy Star compliant house. It's incredibly efficient. Uh, even got a rebate from the power company um, for installing it. Uh, so these are two different houses on the same piece of property. Uh, they're not a duplex. They're what's considered an accessory dwelling unit. So uh, one caveat of that is that the property owner has to live on the property. Um, these houses aren't real good for like a large family. Uh, they'd be better for a, uh, a young couple or a retired couple or a retiree. Uh, and the reason for that is uh, I bought these properties as an investment more than as a home. Uh, you can see the stairway that I installed this summer up to the attic. My wife and I had planned on finishing up the attic and expanding out the back side and living up there and renting out the two lower units. Uh, the rent around here is right around a thousand dollars a month is a good uh, market value for rent. Uh, I only charge 940 right now. Um, so basically the way that works financially I got all the numbers uh, further down on this page but uh, uh, we pay roughly $1,500 a month in mortgage. Uh, that's at five and a quarter percent. Uh, so it's probably it would be less than that. We did 100% financing through the USDA. So our plan was uh, finish up the attic, live up there, and then rent the two lower units out for a profit of $500. Plus we got a place to live. Uh, plus there's a greenhouse, a garage, and a shed and lots of parking here, so we get all that for free. Um, so a pretty good investment. Uh, so what I would say to you is, if you're interested in a, an investment like that, uh, get a hold of a, uh, a broker and lo look into the USDA financing out here. Uh, we were able to get 100% financing through that. Uh, I did a little calculating, and it's right around 1250 if you did 100% financing for the asking price. Uh, so, good luck. Check out the rest of the web page. It's got all the details uh, on the other parts of the houses.